Looks like it's time for the next rodeo, guys. It's the Ace of Vegas. The Ace of Vegas. And Spinners and Sharks, welcome back to Ace of Vegas. Uh, host Ace here. And today I am going to go ahead and play some Binion's Billions. So I'm not sure if you guys have seen the last couple videos I've done where I see if I could get perfect... Uh, Binion's uh, video poker strategy done or if I can do multi-hand strategy perfect and all that It's all part of an experiment that I'm working on where I'm trying to figure out which uh, Which game is actually the best to play? So been doing pretty good in video poker been doing pretty good in uh, In uh, multi-hand video poker. So now I just want to go ahead and try the slots here I decided to pick Binion's billions uh, mainly because you have the option of doing the trivia and the Benny Bucks, uh, which are additional bonuses, where you can actually buy chips uh, with virtual money that they generate for you, and the real chips that you can use to make real uh, hats over here. So it's literally free money to make more free money, which I think is brilliant. So I'm going to go ahead and jack this up to the eligibility of a quarter million. That's uh, usually what I play on the video poker anyway, and we're going to go ahead and put 100 spins on the clock and see how we do on our good set. Ready and go. Okay, so that was our first spin here, and it's not going automatically. Okay, that's an auto spin now. Alright, so I'm not really sure what I'm planning on doing with all these uh, hats when I'm done here. I know I definitely do want to go ahead and have four queens, but I know that four queens is actually working on their own Binion's styled game too. I can't remember where I saw it. They do actually have it on the website though. So when that shows up, really excited about checking that out. And I wouldn't mind actually going there. Maybe perhaps during our, oh, December, November trip or something like that if we make that for the year. And, uh, yeah, we'll just go ahead and see how that goes. And immediately the slots are a little more bland, and I have a lot less control than what I'm used to, and definitely not enjoying this quite as much. I do like the fact that these are simple uh, three placement slots, and it's a five reel slot, so it's a little easier to read. Uh, looks like bare minimum's got to be three of a kind if you want to win something. And they all got to be matched up. There aren't a lot of places for uh, changes there. I know they've got one, one type of bonus. Well, they got two types of bonuses, and it showed us exactly which ones we're eligible for. And then a third one in the free spins. But I can never remember how to get the free spins because I play the slots so infrequently on this game. So that's a result of uh, me not being a big slot person in general. Oh, look at all this! Look at this! What is this? Exploding wilds, where are these gonna go? And that's a big win. What's that, a base? I think that might actually be a base 10 uh, wilds there. Okay, see the game heard me say that I'm not a big slot person. Uh, yeah, we're doing, we're doing just fine game. Th th thanks for letting me know. Go away game. <laughs> And it's just giving me more and more chips. Okay, all right, that's fine. And I got five of a kind on the wild there. Got something completed on my on my list over here. Boom shakalaka. I'm doing something in the achievements pyramid. I'm gonna have to check the achievements pyramid later because I know I'm getting close to that. Definitely gonna have to check on that. If you get a big win somewhere, it really uh, really revs things up. Now, I figured Binion's would really want to encourage you to play the video poker a little more than it does. I mean, it's getting there, but I don't think it always encourages you to play the video poker as much as it really should. That and I'd like to see just more card games in general. I haven't played all the card games here, though. I've really just kind of played Jackson Better or Deuces Wild. I don't really think I've done, uh... Actually, come to think of it, I don't think I've played any, other, any of the other ones. Just Deuces Wild in, uh... Jacks are better, that's about it. Did multi-hand versions too. And then occasionally I'll play these slots over here, but that's uh, that's about it. But I really would like to get downtown one of these times here. Probably take one day downtown because I don't get to go downtown very often. Since most times I go to Vegas, I'm usually going with somebody who's never been there. And for some reason, you just want to take people to the strip. They want to see the pyramid. They want to go ahead and see the... Uh, 
you know, they, they want to go ahead and send Luxor, obviously. They want to send the Sphinx there, and then they always want to go ahead and go to Mirage, watch, watch the volcano, watch the fountains at Bellagio and all that, which is all well and good. I think that's very much the commercialization of Vegas doing its job very well and getting people there, which I think is just brilliant, truly. Really. But still very much... Oh, well, why did it stop here? Okay, I guess we're still working a little more to get another... Oh, we're not going to get that wheel. Darn. But I'm still very much interested. And, uh, just getting getting down to Fremont. Uh, maybe just on a repeat trip with, you know, with somebody else, you know. Or maybe even by myself, see if I can squeeze in some time in between the videos I'm fixing to film on this trip when I go uh, later on uh, later on this month. So, we'll see what we can squeeze in. Let, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Alright, so we're not doing too bad so far. I think we started with about 54 million, we got up, back up to 55 million pretty quickly. We're back down to 50 million already. And let's get a wheel, let's get a wheel. Nope, no wheel for us. Oh, I guess we did get a wheel, but it was too late. They want to give us this Binion's wheel, but I don't think Binion's knows why it wants to give us this Binion's wheel, so it just keeps dropping random ones in. Which is not good for the percentage here, it's not good for the payback percentage. And I'm not really sure where else to go about this. I don't know. I, I, I don't mind going downtown. I think I strongly prefer playing table games downtown. They feel a little bit more fair, which is ironic because, you know, it's still, it's still a lot more old school and you associate old school Vegas with a bit more corruption, with a bit more uh, of the mafia and all that. But somehow the giant corporations, who are actually funding our trips right now, so I'm not sure why I'm bad mouthing them, but the giant corporations kind of feel a bit slicker than uh, those mafiosos were back in the day. Oh, here we go. And they gave us a wheel to shut me up. <laughs> Amazing. Let's go ahead and play. All right, let's spin the Binion's wheel. The phone is asking me to do stuff. I'm gonna clear all these notifications so we can actually play freely. Oh, they gave us a lock? What's the lock for? Locking wild free spins. Okay, that's one of the one of the bonuses here. Let's go ahead and get these locking wilds down. Lock down about wilds, boys. Boom, look at that spin. Look at that spin. Uh girls think we can work out another one. Let's work out another one. Here we go. Another lockdown wild. Alright, now's where it gets interesting. So we just gotta match things in the uh, fourth and uh, second column over here from here on out. Boom, and now if we get something in the second column, anything in the second column over here, we're pretty much winning every single time. And I think we only have a few more of these spins left. Let's see how we do. All right, cool. We gotta win every game now. Every game we got ourselves a win coming up. So every spin going forward is profitable. Look at that, fiery. Feeling like an Eminem, or who does the song? You know, Eminem, right? We're on fire, yeah, that's how you know you're on a roll. You know that one? Now you guys haven't heard that song? All right, I'm gonna have to maybe play a clip of it. Or I might not, I don't know. I got in trouble last time I tried to do a Faith Hill song. All right, last spin, last spin, guys. Hoping for a banger. Let's see what we get. I really could just go ahead and cut the video here, see how we do, but I want to go ahead and do all 100 spins. Be faithful, as I always am. Have a good time. 8.1 million, okay. Brings us back up to 55 million. And some change there. Alright, so let's keep, and there's that mega win. And it's got to celebrate the mega win. Oh, alright. And we are just completing these these uh, pyramid goals here. So I'm going to have to check that after this. 
All right, we got 25 more spins to go, guys. Be killer if we got another one back to back after that. But I'm not gonna be greedy about it, especially since I know it's not gonna happen. Wild's putting in more work there. And Wild's putting in even more work, that's awesome. I think the farthest up north I'm going to go this next time is probably uh, Stratosphere. It's usually a solid place to end it. I don't think I've ever done a video on Stratosphere on this channel. I might have to go ahead and do that. Go up to the Thrill Rides, see if that's something that you guys want to do. Or not, just let me know if that's some, not something you want to do. Or if, I mean, it might not be something I can squeeze in. We can go ahead and see about it on a later trip. I'm trying to get at least two more trips going this year. I know for sure I'll have one in December. And planning on another one before then. Just assuming I can get the time off. So that would be pretty cool. And then I'll just be burning some more My Vegas chips and more My Vegas loyalty points while I'm earning these uh, Binion Silver hats here. So I'd say we're doing pretty good. Oh, we got some wilds coming in. Wild explosion. No, nada. Alright, we've got threes. And I guess if they're just kind of adjacent to each other, you win. Which I think is great. How we doing? Just missed another wild explosion. There we go. And it looks like this might be just about it, guys. And last spin. Nada. Oh, well. Uh, looks like we've ended at 52,162,600 chips. So let me go ahead and take a quick break here. I'm going to go ahead and do some maths, and uh, as we usually do, we're going to count up the booty. All right, guys. So instead of buying chips, I think we're going to go ahead and call it good over here. We came back with a payback percentage of 91.3%. We ended at... Uh, 52,162,600. I accidentally clicked spin one more time, so that don't count. Uh, but we ended up winning some hats over here. I'm just shy of, uh, I think I'm just shy of 4,200 here. Yeah, 4,194. So I'll just go ahead and uh, wait up, get a couple more, uh, get a couple more hat collections by the time I go to bed tonight, and I'll be at uh, 4,200. So that's great. But yeah, 91%, not a bad payback on slots, especially when we have those big jumps there. Uh, I think about 75% of the way through, we had actually made a profit. I probably should have walked away. But for the integrity of the experiment, I had to keep going. No matter, uh, I think we uh, I think we proved our point. So I'm going to go ahead and gather all this data, figure out what to do, and then we'll have a for sure fire strategy of killing minions. But until then, Ace of Vegas is signing out. Strong hands and uh, happy spinning, you guys.